Hey, it's Ray here, and recently on Facebook, somebody was asking how to make sure that you can do the perfect green screen every single time you try. Well, I used to do a ton of green screen when we were in our old office, and unfortunately, since we moved over here, I don't really do much green screen because I don't have a giant office with a painted wall anymore, which means I've got to get a backdrop in order to start doing green screen again. So I'm going to take you into Amazon and we're going to find, hopefully, the perfect green screen backdrop for my situation. All right, so I'm going to go through Amazon here and we're going to look at some green screens and see if we can figure out one that works best for us. Uh, in my old studio, I had a painted wall. It was huge. It was probably six feet, uh, well, it was probably more like eight feet wide and, and went from floor to ceiling. It was fantastic. And it was uh, the chroma key paint, so it worked really, really well. Here at this location, we don't have the space to actually do that. So I'm looking at some of the various options. I don't want to do cloth. I've done that in the past. It, it, it's okay, but not something I want. I want something like this here that's similar to those pop-up signs that you have. So they, they kind of roll up and they lock in place and you can carry them with you because they're nice and compact. And there's a few different options on here. The one that I was originally coming here to look for was the Elgato because it is a, a well-known brand name. It's a very popular one. You can see it down here and it's 154.58, which is a pretty good price for that. And if we click on this here, we can take a look at it uh, you can see it's got the nice little pop-up on the back there. Very cool stuff. Folds down into this bottom tray, the thing that you can then carry around and just stick it in the back seat of your car if you need to take it anywhere. Now, my only issue with this particular one is uh, based on the, the visuals here, it's like, ah, it's not quite that wide. You know, if I stretch my arms out, are my arms going to go off the screen? Not very often that we do that, but it could be an issue. And if you ever wanted to do something with two people talking to each other, you may not have the space to be able to do that. And so I want something that's nice and wide. Now, if we look at the specs here, this is 58.27 uh, inches wide by 70 inches, 70.87 inches tall, which is not bad. That's almost five feet wide by just under six feet tall. Um, not huge, probably good enough for most situations, not huge for $150 that's not a, or $154, not a bad deal. And certainly something we'll take into consideration, but let's take a look at some of the competition out here. So you can see there's lots of different options here. Like this one here is by a company called Newer, and they actually make a, a lot of different products for video production. I've, I've actually got some of their products here that we've used in the past. Um, this one here, $149, so pretty close, a couple of dollars difference from the other one. Uh, but as far as the size of this one goes, this one is, uh, uh, let's see, this one is 58.7 by 74, which makes it pretty much the same size as the Elgato. It's uh, about four inches taller, but quite honestly, does it need to be any taller? That's probably not going to help us much. So the width is the big thing that we want to deal with here. So that's going to be the same for about the same price. So not a big advantage one over the other on that, but of course we do have some other options here as well. So we can take a look at those as we scroll down here. Let's see what else we've got. Uh, this one here is another newer, $161. We can take a look at this one. I think this is probably the same size. So open size is 59 by 77. So an inch wider, a couple inches taller, for an extra 10 bucks, not really much of a difference that really helps us there. So let's keep on looking here. Okay, so now we've got a few different, we've got this uh, E-Mart, Mount Dog, Como, and Yesker. Um, all of these probably just equal in quality, but let's take a look at the size, because the big thing here is we. I would like to get one that's a little bit wider. This one's 61 by 72. 61, you know, eh. Three inches wider, not a, a major difference. Uh, price is 109 though, so that's actually really good. So if we do want to stick with this size, this is the only size we can get, that's probably a good option because it is a little cheaper than the others. Um, not familiar with the brand. Don't know if the brand is, is any good or not, but uh, I'm sure it's not terrible. It's got uh, four and a half stars out from 2,000 reviews. That's pretty good. Mount Dog here. We'll take a look at this one as well. So this one's 58. Uh, by 78. 
So a little again, a little bit taller, but just as wide. So you know, the other ones are tall enough that being a little bit taller is not going to be too helpful for us. But the price is pretty good. Um, same as the others. Como 119 price, and we can see here that this one, um, again, 288 ra ranking, still doing pretty good with that. So this one is 55 by 78, so it's actually a little bit thinner. So definitely the wrong direction for us. Uh, Yesker, $112, good price. And this one here is 57 by 71. Um, you know, 58 by 71. So again, same, same width, so nothing special there except the price is really good. So that might be something we'll wanna look at. Um, but we can keep on ch checking these out. Got all the different pop-ups here. Now this one here, another E-Mart. So this one here is 77 by 92 for 208. So about $50 more, but um, that's a good size. And I wanna check something out here because um, 92 is very tall. Well, let me see here. I'm willing to bet they've got the dimensions backwards. Uh, yes, they do. So this is 92 inches wide, 77 tall. So it's wider than anything that we've gotten by quite a bit, um, almost double, probably about uh, you know 80% wider um, and taller than any of the other ones as well. Uh, so that's pretty good. Actually, there was the, the Mountain Dog was just as tall and the Como was just as tall. But um, boy, this is really good. For that price, that's pretty darn good. Uh, this might be the one that we go for. Um, there's a couple other things that we want to look at. So, okay, so this one here specifically says premium fabric. Um, the other ones are kind of more of a, like a plasticky material. So I don't know if that would make a big difference or not. Um, that kind of looks very similar as far as that goes. As far as the backing goes, looks like a nice backing on there, the struts and everything. So, I mean, this looks like it's a pretty good little product. 232 reviews at four and a half stars. So definitely something we, this may be the one we'll go with here. Um, but let's take a, another gander down here, see if we got anything else that might fit the bill as well. Um, like these types of things here with the fabric, these are not bad. I don't, I don't wanna put them down too much, but I will say the fabrics like these, they don't light as well. Um, they're not nearly as portable. These other ones are so much better for portability. Obviously the price is fantastic, but you're not gonna get the same type of result that you really want with that. Um, let's see, this one here, portable green screens for streamers and creators. I'm guessing this one's gonna be a little bit smaller. Um, oh, this is a category, okay. So let's see, this one is a uh, height of 75. It's 129, it's a good price. And if we take a look at it here, we've got uh, height of 75, what's our width here? 58, so 58 seems to be the popular one. And there's nothing wrong with 58, it's gonna work for most people in most situations, but I would much rather have something a little wider because it just gives us more opportunities to do other things with it. Um, let's go to page two here and see what we've got. So, let's see. This one looks like this is probably that same one that we had before as far as the size goes. Um, wider style, okay. So this one's 199, so about the same as the other one, just a, a slight bit less expensive, but let's see what the size is on this. Um, 78 by 74, so not nearly as wide, but wider than the other one. So this is actually not a good option, but at 199, the other one is much bigger for 199. Um, 78, so you know, this is actually a pretty good size, but again, for 199, the other one was 208 and was much wider. Um, but at the same time, maybe the other one is, is too wide. This one here shows three people on there. Um, so not bad at all. So this could be pretty good. This is another one that's a really good option. So we'll want to uh, keep our eyes on that as well. So this is the wider style Raubay. Raubay, R-A-U-B-A-Y. Okay, let's take a few more looks here. So we'll keep an eye on that one because that's pretty good there. Um, let's see, this is another Mount Dog. Um, 
149 so that's a little bit more expensive than the other mountain dog I believe the other mountain dog was no this is the same one 149 so this is gonna be the same size 58 yep okay so that's the same one as before Emart 107 inch um, this one is not the self-contained one though nothing wrong with that this is um, a good option as well it's a it's a traditional roll down instead of a pop up um, let me see the size of this because at $84 it's a pretty good price so this is kind of like your movie projector style uh, not as portable if you need to bring it anywhere but not a bad option either so this one here is $71.79 not bad that's pretty good but let's take a couple more looks here and we'll make our decision I, I, I'm really leaning towards that um, that one really large one uh, the e-mart one that was very large I liked that a lot so um, let's see so these are not the auto pop-ups uh, here's an auto pop-up by Como 119 that's probably the same one just by a different person All right, let's go to page three. E-Mart 77 by 92, 208. That's the same one. And down here, here's another one here. Look at that price, $87. Wow, show maven. And what's the size on that? Um, actually, <laughs> 66 inches wide. Um, so it's much wider than the other ones but it is a lot cheaper so this could be a good option for people just because I mean it's taller too it's 80 80 inches by 67 inches or 66 and a half inches uh, most of the other ones were 58 so this is a good you know eight inches wider than the other ones um, not massively different but uh, for that price boy if we if we don't want to go with the huge one that might be a really good price to go for uh, as far as quality who knows it's got uh, 153 four and a half star reviews so looks like it's still a pretty good option uh, 101 for this one right here this is by Limo Studio and what are the sizes on this particular one here and they're not gonna tell us or what so I am um, I am not seeing the size on this bad boy see if it says down here so 58 by 70 so that's the size of the other ones but uh, slightly better price but same size uh, the yes 111 that's the same one that we probably looked at before same thing with this one here um, let's see newer 5.6 okay so that's the same there. Uh, E-Mart 109, limited time deal. I'm assuming this is probably one of the 58 inch ones. Uh, oh, actually it is not. Uh, 61 wide, so slightly wider, but not enough to really make a difference on that. Uh, another Mount Dog, which the other Mount Dog that we had it's clearly the same one for the same price. Uh, 71 by 59, so that's not going to be any different. All right, we'll go to one more page, and if we don't find anything on the next page that's different. Uh, 183, for, oh, look at this. All right, so this one is by Julius Studio. Glad we went one more page here, because this one is also 92 inches wide, and... Uh, let me see, 92 inches wide and 79 inches high. So that's really, really good. Um, the other one that we looked at was also was 77 inches wide or tall by 92, but it was 208. So this one actually is about the same size, just as wide, which is what we're really looking for, but for um, about $30 cheaper. Is the quality as good? I don't know. But it might be worth trying at that price because uh, it seems like it's it seems like with a lot of these they're the exact same product just branded differently. Um, boy, that's a pretty good size. Um, 
it looks, I mean, it really does look like it's pretty much the same exact um, screen as that other one. So this might be the one to go for. I'm glad we jumped on this. So this is the Julius Studio. So we may go for that one. Um, let's just keep looking here for one second. We'll see here. This is 73 by 77. 73 by 77. Um, that's not good there. This one is... 199 newer. Uh, let's take a look at this for one second here. So this one is six feet by seven feet. Um, six feet wide. Yeah, you know, it's not really any wider than before. It's a little taller, but I don't care about the tall necessarily. All right, so. Uh, show Maven here, 66 wide. So it's, again, a little wider. It's a good price for something that wide. Um, let's see what size this puppy is. Probably the 58 again for 119. Different company. This is Was Joye. <laughs> the names people come up with, man. Oh man, Mass Was Joy. Yay. I don't know. So this one is 60 by 79. So again. It's that same width that seems to be very popular. Uh, I'll jump one more just since we found a really good one in that last one. We'll take one more gander here, and then this will probably be the last one that we do. All right, not seeing any new and exciting things on this one. So quite honestly, I am thinking that that uh, one that we found on this page here, if we can find that again, which was that... Julie, oh, Juliet, whatever it was called there. If you can find it again. Let's back one more. Now we lost it. <laughs> All right. So let's see here. Limo, Como, where'd it go? Where did it go? Emart, Yesker. <laughs> now I can't find it. <laughs> However, I will find it, and that will be the one that we're going to go with, I think, because it's um, a good size for a good price. So let me pull that up here again. Okay, so I found the uh, Julius Studio one again. Uh, oddly enough, it was not in that search result anymore. It's like it had vanished. I had to search it by name and, and find it that way. Kind of strange. But here it is. So this is probably the one we're going to go with and test, and we will review it to see how it works. But this is the Julius Studio 7.6 by 6.6. Um, you know, 92-inch wide is pretty darn good. We like that. Uh, it's the collapsible that goes into the frame itself so that it's nice and portable. If we take a look at these here, so you can see on the bottom, um, this is what you could just stick into your car or your truck and bring with you. So looks really, really good, very convenient. I love the fact that it's a little bit wider, um, like the show here, the type of uh, a background that it is versus like a muslin backdrop, which we all have troubles with. And you can see there it is, it's an anti-glare. Uh, the wide size. So I think this is definitely the one we want to go with. Quick, easy setup, wrinkle resistant and made of professional screen fabric. Uh, I love it. So this is good. And for the price of $183, so we saved $30 over the larger um, eMart one that we were looking at, which again, I'm not familiar with eMart versus Julius Studios. So either one is kind of a, uh, a crapshoot as far as that goes. But, um, you know, I'm going to do some a little bit more research just to make sure that these guys are a, a, uh, a decent company. They don't have any reviews on this one here, so I'm going to look at some of their other products and see how they've done there. But I think this will be the one, and if for some reason it's not, it'll definitely be the eMart one. And when this arrives between uh, October 8th and 14th, we will do a follow-up video showing how it all worked. And today is the 5th, so it should be here in uh, you know, 3 to 10 days. So we'll definitely do a review as soon as that comes in. Hope this was helpful for you guys. Hope you enjoy this series, and uh, we will talk to you in the next video.